Hey guys, today we're making another plated dish. Um, today's dish is a bison burger with white cheddar and tomato, tomato onion jam. Here's what it's supposed to look like. Okay, here's your ingredients. And here's your directions. Okay, in this box, we've got some white cheddar. We've got some mustard, some Grey Poupon. Remember that commercial? Uh, we got some honey. Got some sherry vinegar. A red onion, a tomato, some parsley, and some thyme, some ciabatta buns. Here's the burger. It's um, bison and um, beef, or like like cow beef. Regular beef. It, thankfully, it's in here, so it's not leaking all over the place. It's in another bag. <laughs> um, and we got some endive, and we got some baby lettuce. Okay, so you're gonna need olive oil, salt and pepper, and a medium pan with a lid, and a large pan. So I'm going to open up the ciabatta buns. I'm going to half the tomato and scoop out and discard the seeds, and then roughly chop the outside. I'm gonna peel the onion, have it, and thinly slice. Then I'm going to pick the parsley and thyme leaves, um, keeping separate, and then discarding the stems. Um, and then I'm going to get a medium bowl, and I'm going to put in salt, pepper, and the um, bison, the beef and bison, um, and then uh, add it um, with the parsley and the thyme. And uh, I'm going to make some patties. So let me get all that started. and we're cooking this for about five minutes until they're soft and slightly brown. Okay, while the um, onions um, caramelize, basically I have taken the other pan and I've started that on medium-high heat and I've added olive oil to it because we're going to cook the burgers um, uh, four minutes and then I'm going to flip them and I'm going to top with the cheddar um, the white cheddar and then cover the pan and continue to cook two to three more minutes uh, depending on how you want your burgers done. Um, and then I'm going to transfer that to a plate and set it aside to rest. Meanwhile with the onions, um, I'm about to add in three tablespoons of water. It's going to steam up a lot um, and carefully, you know, carefully stand back because the steam will you know, it hurts. Um, but once I put in the water, then I'm going to continue to cook about two minutes more. Also, when you're about to add in the water, after you add in the water, turn it down to medium. All right, to the onions, I'm adding in the tomatoes. I'm adding in the thyme. And I'm adding in half the honey. So I'm going to cook this, um, raising up the tomatoes, about six to eight minutes. Here's a look at the burgers really quick. 
but they get a couple more minutes to go. Okay, last but not least, I've added some salt to the, to the tomato jam, and now I'm going to add in half the sherry vinegar. And I'm just going to mix it around a bit. Um, then I'm going to turn off the heat. I'm going to turn off the heat, and I'm going to, um, to put this into a into like a little uh, a bowl <laughs> to preserve. And then I'm going to wipe out this pan so that I can toast the, uh, the buns. While that all cooks, we're going to make the dressing and then toast the buns. So into a bowl with the, you're going to put the salad. I'm emptying out one packet of uh, mustard. The rest of the sherry vinegar. The rest of the honey. And salt and pepper. Whisking, I'm adding in one tablespoon of um, olive oil. Meanwhile, I'm putting um, whichever pan you cleaned out, put it on medium heat, and we're going to toast the buns cut side down two minutes. Okay, lastly, I'm going to have the endive lengthwise. I'm going to cut the core out in a wedge shape and discard. Then I'm just going to thinly slice it and put it in the uh, bowl with the salad. So basically after I cut this, I'm just going to add the lettuce, the parsley, the endive, and I'm going to coat everything. Um, I'm going to put the rest of the mustard on the buns and um, put the bison burgers and then to the tomato onion jam. I'll be back to let you know what I think of it. Hi guys, um, I'm here to talk about the food. Okay, so I thought this is pretty good. Um, I only have a couple of complaints. One is that I'm just, I'm so tired of ciabatta buns. Like, they're just, they're too hard for me to chew and they're just too tough and I just wish I'd have a regular bun to be honest. Um, and it seems to absorb all the flavor of things. Um, so yeah, plus the one that they gave us was like so covered in flour that it was like it just got all over the place and it got all over my clothes and it was just kind of a pain. Um, but that being said, um, the only other thing is that I wish that like the extra mustard had gone into the vinaigrette instead of just having to try and split one more packet of mustard between two people, two people's, um, burgers like that which was like it was like a, a teeny dot of mustard on each and it was kind of ridiculous um but that being said um I really enjoyed the tomato onion jam that was on it I think it complemented the burger um really good um I also really enjoyed the flavor of the burger even though it was literally just salt and pepper um, I haven't had bison before. This is the first time. So I really enjoyed that blend. Um, I thought it was very flavorful. Um, whatever they did to it um, made it really good. Um, I liked the cheddar on top of it. Everything really worked well together. I just wish it had been on a different kind of bun. And the salad was kind of, you know, the usual kind of thing. Um, but I would definitely make it again just, you know, with a different bun. <laughs> Alright, thanks guys for watching. I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!